Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. So today's video is going to be a what I got for Christmas of 2016 video. I know today is um, the first of 2017, which is like real exciting because 2017 came so fast, like I said in my um, best of beauty video. But I just wanted to wish y'all a happy new year before we get into this. I hope y'all had a, you know, fun and safe new years if y'all went out or anything like that. Um, but today's video is going to be what I got for Christmas and this video took forever to film. I know there's probably like a thousand of them already up on YouTube, but I still wanted to upload mine just to show you guys what I got. Um, the reason it took so long is because I have my Christmas with, um, you know, my dad and then I have my boyfriend and then I have like my rest of my family. So it took a while to get everything together and to have, you know, every single Christmas together. So that's why it took so long, but now we're going to film this and my little disclaimer, I'm not trying to show you any of this stuff to brag or just make it look like I'm you know got a lot of presents I'm not doing that in any way to offend anybody um, I'm simply just showing you this maybe for ideas um, or just to see just different gifts or different things you may want to buy yourself so I'm not doing this in any harmful meanful way at all just a little disclaimer there so we are gonna go ahead and jump straight into the video so because this video is probably gonna be 20 minutes long we're gonna start off with the very first thing first and I'm actually going to switch to a different camera angle now that way you guys can see it better so this right here is my vanity girl Hollywood in infinity mirror this is like their new mirror it's solid glass instead of having like white or some color around it and that um plastic i guess that they make the mirrors in but i absolutely freaking love this it still has the light switch and the dimmer on the side as well as the um electrical outlets on the other side this is from my dad and my stepmom so thank you all so very much i absolutely love this mirror and i'm so grateful for it so now that we got the mirror out of the way, we're going to start moving on to more like the smaller item. So first thing, um, my dog actually gets Christmas presents from our cousin and my aunt like every Christmas just because she has two small dogs and she loves to get them presents. So she actually got a new collar. This is from PetSmart. I guess it's kind of like their little um, Christmas set. It has snowflakes on it and she got a new toy. Um, I just thought it was really cute. I don't know why. I just wanted to throw that in there. Um, first little Christmas gift is actually a dupe for the Foreo. I got this off of Kathleen Light's recommendation. This is a Luria. I don't know how to say it. Luria. But it's their, um, it's their version on a Foreo. It's like 40 bucks off of Amazon. And I'm trying to help get rid of, like, these little texture dots and all that crap I have on my face right here. But, um, really love this thing. Comes in a little pouch. It's adorable and pink. About the same size as a Foreo. It has 15 different speed settings. So you can go really fast vibrations really small and um, it has the same little silicone um little brushy dealios but so far so good i actually have noticed a difference with the um texture and just little kind of acne pimples on my face so it seems to be helping so so far it's in a great gift next thing we have right here is a gift from lush and um i got this from my aunt and my cousin and i love lush i'm a huge lush person and this is one of their little gift sets I can't open it up all the way because all the stuff's gonna fall out so I'm gonna tell you which one it was it's the golden wonder it has the golden wonder bath bomb and it's kind of yellow and gold with a big white bow on it then it has a bubbly shower gel so um, I love lush I'm a huge fan of lush I got their whole buy one get one free sale going on I have that bag over here um, but I mean lush you can't go wrong with it so I was super excited with this set another just some like little random goodies I picked up over the holidays were these masks from Marshalls I'm a huge mask person I actually love sheet masks and these are the by nature from New Zealand nourishing and firming face mask with rosehip oil manuka honey hyalur hyaluronic acid argan oil and um, aloe vera so I just want to try something different it had lots of good ingredients in it manuka honey um, I've always wanted to have a mask of that and also the rosehip oil and then I also got some wrinkle care snail 8 mask um as gross as it is the um stuff that snails produce is supposed to be really good for your skin and like have anti-aging ingredients in it so um it's it's never too late to start with the whole skincare anti-aging thing now so i kind of wanted to get into the whole snail thing sounds a little creepy but uh, i'm just gonna like dip my toes in it see how it is the uh, next thing i picked up from ulta and i actually found this on clearance for five dollars but it's the tony moly happy sweet holiday cream foam cleanser duo um i love tony moly he's probably one of my favorite like korean brand of skincare and i saw these on the clearance and i was like oh i'm snagging them up two bottles for five dollars it's normally like around 15. 
Um, they're both a cream foam cleanser. I don't know if there's any difference between it. I'll have to research because this is in Korean, so I can't read it. But um, I just thought it'd be kind of cute. Next thing I got in this cute little Christmas box is actually a gorgeous Kendra Scott set. And I absolutely love it. Super freaking cute set. I'm a huge fan of rose gold and that's exactly what this set is. So as you can see, it comes with tiny little stud earrings and kind of like a rose gold bar style from Kendra. Um, I really kind of like this bar style. I think it's different than her normal, like um, I guess it's kind of like an oval square pin style. Next thing I picked up um, just like I think four little things from Sephora and if you haven't heard Sephora came out with their own take on liquid lipsticks like I think 30 new shades and that is what I got. I got the four shades I have wanted for so freaking long. They were all in stock except one. Um, my cousin actually found it at the checkout when we were checking out. She's like oh my god Taylor did you need the shade? I'm like yes that's the one I wanted. I couldn't find it anywhere. So these are the only four I actually really wanted out of the whole collection. I actually watched Casey Holmes lip swatch video of all 30 of the new shades so definitely go check that video out but the shades I did get were 13, 23, 40, and 41. Really kind of gorgeous mauve pinky nudes. Just perfect for everyday. The formula is really great and comfortable. Dry is matte but they're not too matte where it's uncomfortable. It's just a really great formula. I think they're either 13 or 14 dollars a piece so they are on the more pricey side but I just I couldn't resist. I don't know something about these colors just really intrigued me. Next Next thing I picked up from Ulta, which is actually for my boyfriend because he loves me also very much. I've wanted this for so long, I finally was able to find it. This is the TARDIS Tarte Pro Glow to Go. So I figured out they had this small little set and I was like, I need that because I didn't really find that I would use the big uh, Pro Glow set too much. So I thought this little to go set was perfect. It comes with two highlighters and a bronzer and all three of these shades will actually work for me perfectly. Um, the only reason I didn't want the bigger one, like I did say, I didn't think I'd use it and there was a couple shades in there that I didn't see me getting use out of. So when I saw they had a mini one, I died and since my boyfriend's great and if you're watching this, I love you. Um, I needed that like so bad. The next thing I picked up were two more sets of face masks. These are for Marshalls. They're from the Cream Shop. I think that's how you say it, Cream Shop. Um, this is another Korean skincare brand. I got this one called Let It Glow. It's an ultra, ultra moisturizing jojoba oil sheet mask and this is limited edition. It has five sheet masks in it. And the next one I got right here is called Oh Dear Detoxifying Lemon Sheet Mask. And it also is limited edition with five sets right here. You could probably find these online maybe on their store or something, but I will have them down below. I will have all the products down below, so make sure to check in the description box if you want to find something. Next thing I got from Ulta is actually this ginormous skincare set thing. Um, this is only $10. It was on sale, and it's kind of like a variety pack of different skin stuff. Um, it's their Cleanse and Conquer sample set. And it's a $25 value for $10. You have a Bior liquid cleanser, Burt's Bees cleansing oil, Cetaphil foaming face wash, Formula 10106 10 foaming cleanser, Garnier blackhead scrub, La Roche Pose. I have no idea if you say that. Micellar water, Neutrogena makeup remover towels, simple facial, facial wipes, and skin fix oil foaming cleanser. So you have lots of stuff on. Um, this box that you can try. I thought it'd be kind of a cool thing to try out since it has so many different products in it and you could really kind of get a taste of a bunch of just different skincare options before buying the full size. Next I have gift cards and I got lots of gift cards this year because you know gift cards are just kind of easy and they're simple. You don't have to really put effort into if you know maybe this person that you're shopping for likes to shop. So I did get a pink one which I did spend a little money off that one. I got a Lush one which I did spend money off that one. I have a Sephora one and I had another Sephora one but I already spent that one. That one actually got those lipsticks. I have a um, Starbucks card. I have a, another pink card. I have an Amazon card and a Bath and Body Works card. So gift cards are always great, especially if you don't know what to get a certain person. Next thing I have right here is this little 
the Cream Shop Diamond Deluxe Kabuki Brush. I'm not too sure what this was, but um, I thought this was really cute. I actually did get this for my boyfriend's family, and it's really um, kind of like bedazzled bottom and pink on top. I'm definitely going to display this because I think it's really cute as a vanity piece. Next thing I have right here are some sponges, and these are from my boyfriend, and he got, actually got me, he gets me one every year, but he always gets me another beauty blender. He knows I love beauty blenders, and you kind of just need them all the time. I mean, it's a great gift to get anybody if just anybody likes beauty blenders or sponges for their makeup. So I got another one of those. He also this year got me a new beauty blender solid cleanser. I'm so proud of him. He went to Sephora and picked out great things. So he definitely did good. But um, I also could just use another one of these because I use it to clean my sponges and my brushes sometimes. And then his mom actually got me this little kind of sponge set. It's like a sponge on a stick. Um, I think this would be pretty cool either for cream contouring or concealer. The sponge actually seems extremely soft. I'm sure it's off of Amazon, but um, I'm really excited to give this a try also. Next thing that I have right here is a bag from Sephora that I've wanted for a while. It's says glitter gold and everything bold. I think this is so cute to travel with. I love the bag. I think it's just super cute. It's solid gold all the way around front and back and then the inside is hot pink. I don't know. I just think it's cute to travel with. That was really cute just to throw some makeup products in. I just, I love the saying. I thought it was just perfect and girly. Next up, I got a pair of socks. My dad and stepmom normally like to do like kind of sock things in my stocking. So I got these really cute pair of socks from San Francisco when they went. Um, they are sock monkey and they're like hand knitted. They're really cute and soft. And then they also got me three more pairs of socks. These have sushi on them and they're kind of like, I guess, not ankle socks, but like calf socks. I don't know. There's a certain name for these. But I love sushi. I'm a huge, huge, huge sushi lover. So I thought these were adorable. They also got me um, some sugar skull ones because I absolutely love sugar skulls. I think they're just the cutest things ever. And then they got me these math socks. It says the three things I hate most are math. And I hate math. I... I'm just, it's not that I'm bad at it, but I just don't like it. I'm in college right now, if anybody doesn't know, and college algebra, college anything is 20 times harder than high school, and I just hate math, and these suited me perfectly to my father. And then also from them, I got the Too Faced Melted Merry Kissmas lip Lipstick Set. Ugh. Um, it has three of the Too Faced Melted Lipsticks and a Melted Matte. It has Chocolate Honey Chihuahua Fig and Lady Balls. I love that name, Lady Balls. This is a cute stocking stuffer, which is where I got it. And then I have been wanting this for so long. This is the Living Proof Full Dry Volume Blast Instant Lasting Volume and Texture Spray. Really want this because if you can't tell, I have pretty flat hair. So like on days when I have it straight like this, I could just spray it in at the roots and kind of like vavoom it up a little bit. Give it some life because other than that, my hair is pretty dead. And then um, the most exciting thing is also my new Kylie Cosmetics bag. I got my cousin a matching one just like this also for Christmas. But I thought this was so freaking cute. I wanted her birthday one so bad, but they sold out so quick so I wasn't able to get it. So I saw the holiday one. I was like, I need that because I love bags. I love travel bags in general. So I got the cute one with the lips. It says Kylie on the back. Really cute. Next thing for me is definitely going to be getting some lip kits from her. Next thing right here we actually got in like our um not white elephant but it's a different different like christmas game at a christmas party and um we were playing a bunch of games like that and then we did our annual like family gift exchange one of the things i did get were these really cute um jewelry trays that says follow your heart and it has some gold arrows on it it'll go perfectly with my beauty room and my bedroom since everything is pretty much like gold and pink and then i got this real cute 2017 desktop calendar and it has like a little stand on the back i thought um it'd be really cute it's a really cute gift because like i said i'm in in college and i can write just little dates on it and just have it on my desk the next thing i got which wasn't really part of christmas but my stepmom ordered them a couple days before and i got three new makeup geek shadows i got shimmer shimmer which i obviously don't have peach smoothie and crème brûlée just kind of cult classic makeup geek shadows that i wanted to add to my z palette so real excited for this and i thought you know maybe it was another cute stocking stuffer idea and then also i got this kind of cute little set when we had our um gift my cousin actually sells it works and she put her little like goodies in the bottom of here so it works a body lotion and it the it works peppermint lip balm i actually really like the lip balm i think it's like a real soothing 
strong peppermint flavor, but I actually, I like peppermint, so it kind of tasted good to me. And then these cute socks that ha that said hashtag holidays, and they're real tall. Perfect for next Christmas. I think they're really freaking cute and just like festive. So this next bag is actually from Bath and Body Works, and I used my gift card and only got two things because I couldn't really find anything else that I wanted, so I just decided to get these two because to me they smelled the best. So I got the lemon pomegranate cream shower gel, shower, yeah, shower gel, and then the lemon pomegranate cream um, body lotion. I thought these smelled so good, and since spring is coming up, sadly it's not gonna be cold anymore here in Texas. I thought this would be really cute for in the shower on my nightstand. Next thing I did get from Pink, um, the first thing actually is not from Pink, it's from Dix because I actually had to return a um, North Face jacket to get a smaller size my boyfriend did get to me, which I will show y'all after this, but I decided to pick up this Under Armour hat. I don't know why, but like hats have intrigued me so much lately. Like, yeah, I think they're like so cute. And for days that maybe I don't want to like do my hair or straighten my hair, anything like that, like I think just putting a hat on like this would just be really cute and like just different. I don't know, I've never wore hats, so I, I thought I would like get into it, try it out. So from pink, I did pick up another hat. Like I said, this is kind of like just their tan version. It says pink right here with white. And then I got three pairs of underwear, which I won't show you because that's just weird. It's just a nude, a black, and um, a kind of blushing pink one since they were having like their I don't know I think it's their like semi-annual 75% off sale and then next thing from my cousin I did get some more makeup stuff she got me the Tony Moly mask sheet box this is like his holiday set of mask um I think it has like five sheet masks in it so like I said I love sheet mask and skincare the next thing is this buxom full-on lip cream in white Russian this is like the holiday set it has a big diamond up top on it but the smell of this I could I just literally died when I smelled it and it like the color of it is so pretty it's such a light kind of pinky nude and it's just like perfect for every day and it kind of tingles a little bit to plump your lip next thing is this makeup revolution matte blush and this is in nude um it's just a really pretty kind of everyday blush shade and then the new wet and wild um i think it's like their cat suit yeah liquid cat suit liquid lipsticks and this is in rebel rose again just a nasty like a dusty rose kind of shade and then i have been wanting this for so long and she actually found it and got, gave it to me as a christmas gift this is the next strobe of genius highlighting palette i think this is so freaking cute like I absolutely love this. I love the colors in it. I think they're just a bunch of different fun colors in it that you can highlight with. And then the next thing in here is the Ulta Beauty Complexion Perfection Blending Sponges and Setting Spray. It has two of the blender sponges, which are supposed to be really great sponges. And then this matte setting spray, which is obviously supposed to make your foundation matte if you have anything glowy or maybe you have oil. So I thought this was a really cute set to try, especially with the sponges. Next thing my boyfriend actually picked up for me for Christmas and it's from James Avery. It's their um, heart, I don't know what kind of, I think it's like heart to heart bracelet. I have the um, same necklace of it on, but it has the two connecting heart bracelets. I think it's really cute. It is one of their like kind of bangle style bracelets. The next thing he got me from Pink, because he's an awesome boyfriend and he knows my taste, are these adorable pink leggings. Um, it's kind of like that new um, style they have. It has the crisscross right here. And they are leggings, like I did say, so they get tight at the ankles, but they're solid black, and I think they're so cute. These are a medium. Um, I just absolutely love these. They're yoga leggings, and they're just so comfortable and so cute. He did a really good job this year, and I'm so proud of him. I could say that like 20 times. And then he also got me another set of pink leggings. These are actually gray, and they're more of like a workout style, but they're still adorable. They have a thicker band. And then all the way down, they have a hot pink strap going towards bottom, and they say pink on the side. And I just think these are so cute, and they're so comfortable. Like I said, I'm in school, so these are real simple for me just to kind of throw them on the morning with a shirt or something. And then I got the Bath & Body Works Frosted Coconut Snowball Body Spray, and then also somewhere in here, the Matching Lotion. I absolutely love these two. I think they are just seriously amazing. They smell so good. I mean, the whole coconut, the coconut scent, coconut, I said that's so weird. The coconut scent seriously has me probably thinking it's their best scent yet because I love the whole coconut. Like, it just smells so good to me. 
me. But that is everything for my What I Got for Christmas video 2016. I hope you guys did enjoy this video. Um, please make sure to give it a thumbs up and also subscribe before you leave. I really want to reach 200 subscribers. That way I can do a really great giveaway for you guys. I mean, it's really insane to think I'm at 156 right now, but I wish we could just keep growing and growing and growing. It's just always been like a dream and goal of mine. So I would love to hit 200 so I could just, you know, give back to y'all and do a giveaway. And yeah, I hope y'all had a great Christmas and a great New Year's 2017. I hope it's going to be a great year for, you know, my YouTube channel. Hopefully we can grow, maybe hit a thousand subscribers. Again, you know, it's always been a goal of mine just to do that. But like I said, hopefully, you know, we can just hit the goal, hit the dream, you know, all that jazz. But um, I will see you guys in my next video. Bye, guys.